The topic of this video, it's not dark as it may seem. In my head, feeling pain and actually how I connected to loving your pain is a process of transformation and uh, loving your transformation path. So it's not about loving the fact that you are struggling right now or you are in pain right now, physical or emotional, but leaving that emotion, feeling that emotion of, uh, of a loss, of pain, of just uh, not knowing what to do next is normal and uh, it is actually something that can, that can make us grow as, uh, as human beings, as uh, individuals. It can build our character and uh, we can become more, you know, with a more thick skin. It's not something that you can't even control, it can just happen in your life and that's it. Um, so what happened to me, I'm not sure if I'm going to include this in the video, uh, is that uh, recently my grandmother passed away and uh, that feeling and that the the whole thing was really, really, really new to me. I had like not like I had um, other relatives that passed away in my family like when I was younger, but they were more far away relatives. And um, as a teenager, or as a child, or as a young adult, I was more like I was not really connected to this situation. Yes, it happened and. But this time, since it was a very close person, I experienced it in a totally different way. And uh, I know that it's, if I can tell it this way, but it's for the best because she's going to feel, she, wherever she is right now, I, I believe she's feeling better rather than being here sick. So the last week, it was really intense, obviously because of that. It affected other aspects of my life as well. My mindset in general, I was working, I was like trying to keep myself busy. I was most of the time at home. I was trying to go for walks and for running. It made me really feel better and uh, I also was trying to talk with friends, either on the phone, either meeting, like I had uh, friends coming uh, over and that was really nice and um, I'm just happy that um, the people that I reached out, they were, um, they were, they were very warm to me and uh, they were actually there, giving me their time to to just express myself, to talk and just to maybe laugh over something else and that was really nice. What I'm thinking right now about pain and about any kind of pain doesn't matter, it doesn't have to do only with death, death is obviously the last, you know, uh, point uh, where the pain is actually very big but I'm talking about in general about any kind of pain any kind of emotional pain that we may feel during our lives I think it is it sucks to actually live this have these moments but also it is important to actually have these moments we may not realize it right now when we being in that situation but later on it is something that will actually bring us to a conclusion that, oh, it was important for me to feel this way. So now I can create a specific path for myself. I have already that experience, so uh, I can get into my conclusions, I can get new insights and actually be more grateful about what I already have because 
well, what, what death uh, right now showed me, like I mean, experiencing death with a really close person is that life is too short, maybe to stress over and war and worry over small, really small things or life is too short to to be angry on somebody or to be stressed about uh, some working tasks or about some even some problems in our lives that yes maybe they are seem big right now but the thing is that we can overcome them we always can find a solution i am a big believer in that and yes nothing can beat uh, death because after that you're like if you are not here in this world you don't you don't you don't have these problems that you're experiencing right now so you don't have anymore this experience if it makes sense so i think it's really important to cherish every moment of challenge every moment of uh, maybe bitterness or maybe even feeling the pain but the good news is that the pain is not forever it may, it may come from time to time the memories or um, like it may occur to us that oh I may have acted dif in, a di in a more different way what really happens after is that we can we can never be in the same condition like we we always change we are like this we can definitely feel better and this is like the 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 main thought that i want to keep for myself i felt that it's important to share it and to express it get rid of it it helps me in in some way to realize what actually happened and that my feelings are okay and it's okay to feel like this and it's totally normal to leave yourself to feel the pain as long as you need it and not to be afraid to seem you know weak or or a little negative it's normal. It's normal to to be in 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 low vibrations and to, to be in some in a condition that it's not always positive. It's it's not like it's uh, impossible to be positive all the time. And it's normal to feel any kind of pain. <laughs> Привели нас сюда, показали корабль, и уже потом удачи.